Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. I matched my phone case today. We have this orange thing going on. I am bubbly today because we are gonna shop. Do you guys see what shopping does to my mood? My mood instability costs me. I am going to amazon.com right now because today we have an Amazon video. My first Amazon video on this channel. As you guys know, Amazon has pretty much anything anyone could ask for. I never gave Amazon clothing a try. When I think of Amazon, I think of like useful, gadgets, dishes, mugs, lights, lighting, equipment, tripods, like useful things. I don't think of clothing. To my surprise, anytime I see someone wearing a cute outfit and I ask them where they got it from, they respond to Amazon. And on my For You page on TikTok, if I like an outfit, their reply in the comments is Amazon. So I wanna check it out. Let's just type, you know, for the hell of it, Y2K. I hate myself, I know. These are cute. Women sexy Y2K e-girls 90 sleeveless face portrait print crop top tie-dye vest tank top graphic print top summer. <laughs> we'll add you to the cart. I also really like this yellow and black one. This looks like stuff I see on Depop. Part of me is wondering if people buy these and sell them on Depop because this looks like what I come across. <laughs> Stop for a second, recording here and on there, and pose for thumbnail. <sighs> Guys, um, the lighting's really different because it's kind of 11.45 p.m. I filmed the intro and then I got hella sidetrack and I'm picking back up with it at night. I'm actually kind of happy about this because I feel like I'm weirdly a better shopper at nighttime. Let's shop, I'm, I'm excited. Y2K bag. Oh my god, this is that influencer bag. The actual brand is, I have it saved because I wanted to buy one myself, unless this is the same. Oh my god. It's not a dupe, this is the real thing and it's gonna come by August 3rd literally in a day and a half. I'm gonna buy the green one. I want like tacky red early 2000s glasses. I like these, these are cute. All right, fuck it, 20 bucks. House of the Sunny Dupes. Oh my god. Why are these so cute? $11.99. I'm gonna add this button up. I'm so shocked. I like, honestly, like how chill it is. Like just throw it over anything. I need more of those to be honest. My go-to is just Y2K clothing. I'm not in the mood today. Nothing better than tacky quotes on shirts. Adding to cart. Oh, I like this black and red butterfly top oh my god i'm literally obsessed i'm obsessed i can't believe i'm getting this on camera right now i don't know what else to buy i think we're good let's go to proceed to check out order placed august 9th the 14th so technically yeah it'll take two weeks for the last piece to arrive so hopefully i'll see you guys in two weeks hopefully it's not a month and we're gonna try amazon clothing so yeah i'll see you guys once these packages get here and i'll give you guys a try on haul all right guys so as you guys saw at the start of this video i had different hair and that's because it was a month earlier hopefully it's not a month so everything came in and I'm excited to try on everything because it's been a month and you know what if this is a hit then like great We can buy clothes on Amazon too, but I do have to say right off the bat the packaging is interesting <laughs> Okay, this tag is in another language But you know what everything I picked out was really cute, but like look at the way it's coming. This is a cloudy bag This is not the color I ordered. This is like green This was supposed to be a white t-shirt and we did it again I accidentally ordered two of the same thing because I always do that every haul Oh, and we have another cloudy bag with a tiny tank top. Okay, so let's get into this haul. First impressions, I am not impressed with the packaging, but then again, it's Amazon. Um, but these all came, I wish I took a picture. They were all wrapped in gray Amazon packaging one by one, like in balls. Literally just crumbled up. Amazon package one, crumbled up. Amazon package two, crumbled up. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna unpackage is the one that is the most enticing to me. I ordered this. I actually don't think I filmed myself ordering this because I think I was sitting on the couch. So I found this like fairy core Y2K crossover spaghetti strap blouse. The quality is actually good. $13. Whoa. 
I actually give this a 8 out of 10, 9 out of 10. I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. Next up, this is like a trend I've been seeing everywhere. Not Nikki buying into trends. I'm sorry, but this trend caught my eye. I love random shit on my shirts. I love, love, love like muscle fit tank tops, especially like this. I'm literally wearing one. These are the two shirts and I love the colors. We got this. I'm not gonna lie, it looks a little big and the fabric is giving me Halloween costume. The yellow on the back and the fabric is giving me, I'm gonna be a firefighter for Halloween. I like this. I envisioned an outfit and I envisioned it well. I give this an eight out of 10. I only took away two points because I would like the girls held a little nicely in place. I love the fabric, but if it was a little more fitted, this would be like 10 out of 10. This is a smaller fit. Oh my God, I love this. I love red and black so much. And I love that like, the butterflies are almost like x-ray vision. Like you could see through, I don't know, I probably sound so dumb. Where you like reverse the colors and everything's white and blue. I'm having a brain fart. Comment down below if you know that effect I'm talking about. This looks like such a Nikki fit. This isn't even funny. It looks like your normal wardrobe. Yay for me for finding my style and shopping within my style on Amazon. My eye goes right to my red beaded bag and the girls are in good place. I rate this a... 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10. Okay, next one, cloudy bag. What is this? So I guess this is good news, but <laughs> I forgot to include this green bag and these Y2K red glasses because I actually used them in a previous vlog of mine where I go to New York City with my friends. Guys, I received so many compliments on these glasses and this bag, especially on Instagram. And a lot of you guys have been asking where I got them from and they're from Amazon. These pieces, like I use all the time and it makes me wanna go to Amazon specifically for my accessories. This, I actually forgot I ordered this. I'm not in the mood today. Like that's so mean. And I love a good blocky, chunky, tacky, cheesy print. I think it's so fun. And I notice everybody's doing that. Like I think that's a very Y2K trend. I promise I'm only buying into the trends that I really truly envision my style doing well. I am really, 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 I think this past summer I've really focused on trying not to just buy into every trend. I feel like during the quarantine, I got bored and I started going on Pinterest a lot and I started buying into every trend. And then all of a sudden I did like six closet cleanouts later, I realized, oh my God, I need to stop this habit, this cycle. I have seen some of your comments and I am trying to ask myself before I buy something like, is this trend something I would actually wear in my style in my closet or is this a trend that's going to be literally three months long and die down and you wouldn't wear it if it wasn't a trend now we're gonna have a little situation with this one because it did not look like this on amazon i can tell you that right now that's white this is an oversized band t-shirt vibe i'm a little bummed i'm not gonna lie because there's this photo of this girl on her bed in leather pants with this top fitted let's see how it looks on maybe i'll end up liking it I don't like the neckline. It's a scoop neckline and I want it to just be like a t-shirt high neckline. I hate this wide scoop. I don't like that. Not what I pictured. All right, so now I wanted to tie in something you guys would actually wear. A lot of people lately have been wearing those like button ups that have like plaid or patterns and they're wearing just like basic white crop tops underneath. Oh, oh, uh-uh, uh-uh. I'm getting scrubs or my nani, my grandma. <laughs> Wearing it with like a hat. <laughs> it does not look like that. This isn't what I bought. It's the cut of it. Like these sleeves are awkward. All right, let's see, let's hope, let's pray. Nothing's worse than tight sleeves. It makes you feel gross. Um, I actually don't hate it. No, I do hate it. <laughs> this is giving me like Sometimes down on vacation is a vibe, but these sleeves are not a vibe. All right, I give this a four out of 10. Like, I was really excited about this one. Okay, last but not least, I'm excited about this. I kind of already opened it. I've already worn it for a Nikki and Gabby intro and thumbnail. I'm gonna act like this is my first time opening it, but seriously, I actually like this. This honestly looks really good, like fire with these pants and it's ribbed. I love a ribbed crop top moment. This is it. I love this. It's a win, it's a 10 out of 10. Wow, what a ride, what a ride. No, but for real, um, I think that I will use Amazon 
with more of an open mind now. Um, I feel like I used to just use Amazon for like go-to last minute things. There were some pieces in here that I know are gonna be in my closet for at least a year or two. So to me, that like passes the vibe test. So I, I'm, I'm mixed because some pieces were really misleading and others were perfect. So I'm in the middle, I'm 50-50. I think it's a hit or miss on Amazon, but that's the risk you take when you, you know, buy fast fashion. Um, yeah, so <laughs> comment down below if you guys wanna see me do more videos like this, like try out things. I like trying things. I love fashion. Oh yeah, I love you guys so much. Be sure to subscribe. There's so much coming. I keep emphasizing that, but like we got new hair. You know things are coming when we got new hair, okay? So yeah, I love you guys. Subscribe. Follow me here on Instagram, TikTok, and follow my Spotify. I'll have my Spotify pop up right here. I'm really trying to grow my Spotify. That is like where my focus is, like YouTube and Spotify, literally. I'm gonna be putting out an EP for you guys, literally so soon. If it's not out by now, then it's coming out like so soon. But yeah, I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Love you.